Team Profile, The Rebels, Episode 2, Rugby Troopers, One-on-One. -on -one. Peter, Fünf. Christian, Elf. Dirk, Vier. Sani, Drei. André, Zwei. Mike, Zehn. Ani, Coach. Rugby. Hart, laut, schnell. Wir sind die Rebels. Peter Schreiner. I'm Peter Schreiner, 41 years old, and I played wheelchair rugby since 1992, since it debuted in Germany. Rugby means a lot to me. I've always been keen on sports and tried out a lot. I was a sports freak. And after my accident, I realized that I could play rugby. This sport helped me get my life back. It helped me set new goals. Talking about motivation, to me it's all about having fun. I'm 41 now, an old hand, but I can still keep up with the juniors. Whoa! My name is Hani Albavadi. My name is Hani Albavadi, and I'm 38. I've always been into wheelchair rugby, and after my sporting career, I wanted to remain part of it. That's why I decided to become a rugby coach. Do I really need to say why I love the sport? Just watch it, and you'll know. Well, my name is Mike Bauman, and thinking about wheelchair rugby, of course, I enjoy the competitive part of it. But considering all the expenses it requires, and the time I invest, I'll just say that the fun factor is most important to me, and I've been enjoying the game for years. For that reason, I'll stick to it as long as I can. And now, let's go. We're Rebel Zeit. Hello, my name is Sali Kuzoglu. I'm Sali Kuzoglu, 30 years of age, Wheelchair rugby is a full contact sport. The game is tough, fast paced and explosive. Anything goes. It requires real skill, regardless of the disability. We have to push, pull, roll and give our best. It's tough, both physically and mentally. It's difficult to combine work and the professional sporting career. Working eight to ten hours a day, it's hard to squeeze in two to three extra hours for training. But it works. In the end, it always works, somehow. Christian Götze here. I play rugby with the Rebels from Karlsruhe. I'm 35. Rugby is just great. I enjoy it very much. Rugby means a lot to me. Sometimes it's tough to be on the road most of the time, to keep the balance between sport and private life. But I'm still here enjoying it. I'm a part of the team, and the team has become a part of me. It's a pity that Mikael couldn't be here because of a shoulder injury. Me, I, I don't put disability first. I'm just an ordinary guy with an ordinary life. I wake up in the morning, get into the chair, and in the evening I get out of it. And that's it. Just like putting on shoes for an able-bodied guy. So please, just save your pity for someone else. Oh, the poor guy, and wow, he even plays rugby. I'm just a guy doing a sport. Enough said. I'm Dirk Schmidt, 34 years old. 
I wanted to get back into sports some years after my accident and work out just like before. That's how I discovered wheelchair rugby. I've always been keen on different sports, and rugby became one of them. I play rugby because it's an endurance sport, it's a team sport, and there's a lot of action. Our nights in shining armor are Victor and Thomas. They're always on site, taking care of everything and everyone. We couldn't do without them. Würde es auch gar nicht funktionieren. Das wäre gar nicht möglich. Ja, gut, was habe ich auf dem Rücken? The tattoo on my back. It's a concubine. Always by my side, the one woman who will never run away from me. Die mir halt nicht davon läuft. Just joking. <laughs> Super. My name is Andre Leonhardt and I'm 33 years old. I'd been into kickboxing for many years and after the accident I was missing the full contact of it. I can't beat up my kids and my wife. I love them. That's why I started looking for a sport where I could beat up someone else. I'm only kidding. The first time I saw rugby, I knew it was the right thing for me. Rugby is cool, involves plenty of strategy and tactics. Just a really interesting sport. Back to the game. Oh, oh, yeah. Great zone defense. That's love, isn't it? Yeah. A little bit. 